Chuck Rock and it's time for more video games, so let's go to them right now. This very second, our first game today is going to be on the computer using the 3DFX technology, and it's called none other than... Da -da 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 -da. Are you ready? Driver. Driver. That is right, and this game is totally awesome, and you'll see graphics like you've never seen them before, and hear stuff like you've never heard it before, and I would like to welcome our co-host, Miss Marge. Hey, baby. Hey, Chuck. How you doing? I'm doing okay. That's Are you good. okay? You don't look okay today. I never look okay because I'm a big, fat, bald man, and I can't help it, but I don't care. And I would also like to introduce our guest host, Mr. Cassidy. What's up, dude? Hey, Chuck Rock. Hey, man. Hey. Hey, but check this out. Driver on the computer. Look at the graphics. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. I tell you, let's go to the rock line real quick before we go into the game. And let's go now. You're on the rock line. Who's this? This is Dak. Hey, Dak. How you doing? All right. All right, man. What do you think about Driver on the computer? Look at the graphics. Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah. All right. Hey, man. Where are you calling from? Asheboro. Asheboro, North Carolina. And you've called before, hadn't you? Yeah. I remember you. Hey, check this out, man. What do you think? Uh, well, no, let me ask you a question a week. You ready? Sure. What's your very favorite game of all time? My favorite game of all time, WrestleMania 2000. WrestleMania 2000, and that's on the... 64. 64. Okay, dude, thanks for calling in. All right. You take it easy. You too. Hey, guys, you're watching Chuck Rock Live. We're showing you Driver on the computer. It's awesome. We're going to take you into the game right now, the actual gameplay. Check it out only on Chuck Rock Live. This is Driver on the computer, and man, what awesome graphics. Now, Cass, when we downloaded this game, we were like, oh, my goodness, look at it. Could they please make it for the Dreamcast? Oh, yes. Now, do you realize that the Dreamcast will have just as good of graphics as this when they come out? And I guarantee you, I have talked to GT Interactive this past week. They are signed on with Chuck Rock Live, and they said as soon as they have a release date, they will let us know. But, guys, you are looking at Driver. And, of course, the rating on this game is T for Teen. It's on the computer and, of course, also available on the PlayStation. But it's time to go to a commercial break so we can pay our bills. We're coming back with more extraordinary video games only on Chuck Rock Live. It's my bath time. There's nothing I like more than a good, warm, cozy bath. In fact... I think I'll just turn this heater up a little bit. Bonehead, but at least he got to keep his soul. Introducing an epic vampire's world where your enemies don't just die, you take their souls. Raziel and Soul Reaver from IDOS Interactive. PlayStation. Baseball, America's favorite sport. Now you can improve your skills all year round at the Hitting Zone. The Hitting Zone has three batting cages and the latest model of the Laser Ball. This cage is the only one in the country, and the Hitting Zone has it. Cage rentals are available for individuals and teams. The Hitting Zone offers private or group lessons, on-site hitting instructors, hitting leagues, bats, gloves, and T-shirts. We're available for your end-of-season team party or on-deck birthday parties. For more information, call the Hitting Zone at 794-1300 or come by the Hitting Zone, 1612 South Stratford Road, Winston-Salem. Chuck Rock will be right back in one minute. Don't go nowhere. Looking for the widest selection of the hottest titles of video games? Look no further than the best. Player's Choice. At Player's Choice, we carry more games than the big chains because that's all we do. Check out these awesome new titles. Tokyo Extreme Racing plus Soul Calibur featuring state-of-the-art graphics. Available now for the new Sega Dreamcast system. Player's Choice, your choice for the latest video games with five triad locations to serve you. Player's Choice, serious fun. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm feeling the love. You feel the love, love. Yeah. 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 
the leg, young pay you what they call me the club. How you feeling the die? Yo, I'm feeling the love. Feel the love, love. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chuck Rock with the Video Game News. Sony Computer Entertainment of America announces past Thursday that its PlayStation business surpassed movie box office receipts during the month of October. In addition, the company announced that it expects PlayStation branded products such as hardware, software, and peripherals to top $1 billion in sales for the 1999 holiday season. In the Sega Spotlight, the 128-bit, internet-ready Sega Dreamcast has been named the 1999 Machine of the Year by Time Digital, which is Time Magazine's publication devoted entirely to personal technology. Sega Dreamcast was chosen as a leading technology product for the year, beating out products such as MP3 players and personal video recorders. The honor is part of Time Digital's special holiday edition, which is dated November 29th, and it will be out at newsstands this coming Monday. For more information on this and any other video game related news, go to www.chuckrocklive.com. And now for the games that were released this week. For the PlayStation, Toka 2, Test Drive 6, NBA Showtime, Toy Story 2, Twisted Metal 4, ah, that's a good game, NCAA Final Four 2000, NBA Live 2000, and 007 Tomorrow Never Dies finally came out. On the Nintendo 64, NBA Showtime, WWF WrestleMania 2000, and Major League Soccer, and finally for the Dreamcast, Slave Zero, WWF Attitude, Psychic Force 2012, <laughs> and NBA, stop laughing at me, and NBA Showtime. My video game pick of the week this week is Medal of Honor for the Sony PlayStation and will also be on next week as Game of the Week. Remember, visit our website at www.chuckrocklive.com for any and all the gaming information you need. Hey, and now let's go back to more extraordinary games only on your show, Chuck Rock Live. <laughs> you can breathe now. Yes, yes, I can breathe now. And we're going to take a look at oh, Space, Space Invaders. Invaders. Now, Marge, this is more your speed. Oh, you yeah. Know? Just a kind of... Uh, a game that came out 80 years ago when hey. Marge was just a teenager. And I, I don't think so. Well, Marge, you're just old and ugly, and <laughs> nobody can even help you. You know that? That's the bad thing where's about it. Where's my gun? What do you mean, where's your gun? No, no, I, put put that thing away, Marge. But, ow, Marge, ow, that, oh, golly, that hurt. Ow, it stuck to my head, and I can't get it off. Oh, good, you got a good red spot on Oh, there. that's oh, man. wonderful. Thank you so very much. No, don't, don't, don't have her do that. Anyway, Space Invaders. Now, this is an incredible game, and, like, okay, here's the deal. If you grew up many, many years ago, okay, and you played this game, yes. you're, it's one of the games that started it all. It That's started right. everything. That's right. And they brought it back, and I thought they did a marvelous job. Now, I know it was a very difficult game. You have to go through, like, ten levels before the background even changes. Now, that's one of the only things I didn't like about it, but the gameplay was choice. You can play one or two players at the same time. It was completely awesome. And, uh, I mean, look at it. It's got a 100 explosive 3D levels. Why you is your gun glowing? My gun glowing? Your gun's glowing. Well, because I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you glow when you're happy? Oh, because I have a shield. That's a special oh, that's shield. A shield. That I, right, I picked that up as I was playing. Oh. Yeah, this is the one-player mode, and see, this is one of the challenge modes right here. You go through, and you try to get all the little things, and believe me, this game gets harder and harder as time goes on. Yeah, the first boss is impossible. <laughs> oh, I know. The first boss was like, he, oh, there he oh, is. Oh, there he is. Yeah, and he got me. But we're going to go to the two-player mode now, and this is where Cassidy and I were playing, and we were rocking and rolling, weren't we, man? We were rocking and rolling, man. Yeah. Hey, but you can test your rapid-fire skills against 13 enemy species and huge alien bosses on 10 space worlds. Isn't that cool? Yeah, not a bad game. Space, hey, let's take you into the game real quick and uh, take a look at it, only on Chuck Rock Live.